First, I want to start off by thanking everybody who commented on my last video, like, and subscribed to my channel. I really appreciate the support. Next week's winner is Humbloom. I have already sent you a message on Wahas, but if you happen to see this video first, congratulations. Please send me a message with the information on who I am drawing for you for next week's Free Art Wednesday. Today's video is featuring a commission that I received through Etsy from the wonderful Kegs. They wanted me to draw one of their Tempest Wahas. If you follow me on my social media pages, you would have already seen this. I think I posted it uh, a couple weeks ago. It's one of my favorite pieces, so I figured it could be fun to make a video of. Um, I do have a lot of other pieces that I have not made videos of, so I gotta do that at some point. I do have the content. If you guys are interested in doing another questions and answer, please let me know. I know I keep going back to those, but you guys seem to enjoy them. I usually get a good amount of uh, feedback. So just let me know and um, you know, maybe we can do that for the next video. I learned a valuable lesson from my previous video, Blooming Lime. Thank you again for bringing this to my attention. Um, I'm actually supposed to provide a script for my YouTube videos that are used for the subtitles. I actually thought that was a feature that was automatically worked on its own. I didn't realize you had to supply that for it. So lesson learned, today I'm working from a script which I know will probably change how I sound. But um, you know, I, I figure it's all a learning process anyways. If you guys have suggestions on how I can improve my videos, don't ever hesitate to speak up. I do appreciate the feedback and without it, I won't improve. Or at the very least, I won't improve as quickly as I would have with the feedback. Oh, and if you make it this far, make sure you include Horses Rock in your comment along with your account ID. Going to give everybody who does this a gift on Wahas on Sunday. Remember those old horse items that we had way back when? Um, they're gonna come back and I've redrawn the artwork so it's improved quality but it still pays respect to the original design so you'll recognize them right away if you were around Wahas at that time. I hope that you guys like them and what better way to release them than a little giveaway through one of my videos. The horse you get probably won't be exclusive to the video here because I know not everyone is paying attention but you will definitely be one of the first to get it. So you can post a rave should you wish to and give a little tease to our non-video watchers. I do have a few new features for them that we didn't have before. So it's a little old, little new. And Mike just came. Are you throwing stuff at me? Maybe. Come on, don't throw stuff at me. That's your contribution to the videos, you throwing stuff at me? Well, no. That and a uh, PSA. What's your PSA? Stop ordering shit off of Amazon. All of you. Oh, he says that because he works at USPS and he had a ton of stuff he had to do. Too or much. to deliver. Too much. And say, I don't buy a lot off Amazon. <laughs> yeah. Just normal stuff. <laughs> <laughs> You're what's called an Amazon queen. I am not an Amazon queen. Yep. I bought, I bought stuff for Lucia's birthday. That's what I bought recently. Etsy, on the other hand, is a dangerous place. Yeah, it does. You said Amazon, that's Etsy. Whatever, same difference. It's all trash. No, it's not. Yep. Etsy, you're at least buying things that other artists made. Yeah, like that one dog horse thing you got that is like all blue. Oh, you mean... Oh, I don't know if we should be putting that in the video, though. Probably shouldn't. She has rabid fans. Yeah, let's pass on that. <laughs> no, she does. Like, I guess anyone that speaks out gets into a lot of trouble. So I went back and censored out her name. Not sure we want that kind of drama on the channel. Um, but maybe sometime later I can post a little review on some of the dolls that I have purchased. I've definitely collected a few artists who make some amazing dolls that I wish I could just buy all of their stuff. Um, there are some artists out there who are just amazing at making dolls. Uh, it's a dangerous hobby to be in. It's dangerous to look at Etsy. Um, but I'm going to wrap the video up here. If you like what you see, please consider commenting, liking, and subscribing. All that YouTube stuff. And um, I will see you guys next week for the next Free Art Wednesday. Uh, like I said, I'm going to try to do at least one video a week. But maybe I can do two. We'll see. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. And I will chat with you guys later.